Howdy folks, Tech Texan here, bringing you Elite Dangerous. Now, several things to go over. One, a new update. This game is now in Gamma. It is no longer in Beta. It is now Gamma. They have unlocked the, uh, the boundaries and you can now explore the entire galaxy. Second update, I am currently recovering from sickness. I had fever. I was kind of out all week, not due to sickness, but uh, family sickness I had to take care of. And uh, now that I got sick, so I'm now recovering. I've been posting a lot of pre-recorded stuff online, but uh, I am now bouncing back and trying to get back into business here. And I am starting off with Elite Dangerous because, oh, I love this game. I haven't even, I haven't even had the chance to buy another vehicle. And unfortunately, the update has taken away all my credits. I had 44,000 credits, but now I'm down to 100. Actually, I'm less than 100 because I just bought some fuel traveling around. So, uh, you can tell my voice is a little hoarse. <clears throat> so I'm still recovering. You'll hear, uh, a little bit of, uh, <clears throat> voice going uh, in and out now and then but we are now at lunan dock and we are uh currently in the what is it Roz system or something like that let's see Roz 210 so um yes they have unlocked the galaxy so you can now have the chance to travel to seoul and looking at the galaxy map i don't know for some reason i could not uh select it i i can select it as a destination but it didn't exactly show me how to get there so Unless I literally just click through all the systems. But I'm wondering if it's because I don't own all the cartographies. Well, in order to do that, I need to earn some money. Well, I gotta earn money to buy fuel to get there anyway. So, whether I like it or not, I need to go find some bad guys and do something about that. Alright, so let's go ahead and launch. Whoa, hello. It's not crashing anything. That would be a bad start. Uh, I do notice that it runs a little smoother, so they have done some other optimizations. Uh, I also noticed that in the skybox, uh, you can actually view some nebula clouds. Let's see if I can find one in sight. Come on, I saw some earlier. Okay, that was... Oh, look! Sole destination. I guess I did lock it in. Something tells me I don't have the fuel for that. Hmm... Now, I, now, I'm tinkering with the controls a little bit. Uh, I noticed that they added frame shift and hyperspace are now two different controls. So I don't know if doing this is actually going to do that. Okay, I see. So, because the fuel required to get there is far more than what I have, I cannot travel. It says, sorry, frame shift uh, canceled. You don't have the fuel to get there. Sorry, buddy. So I can't take any direct flight there, obviously. Oh, check out that nebula. Ah, that's so cool. I love it. And you can actually travel to those places if I'm not mistaken. I'll try to do that when I can. So yes, what I'm going to do is I am going to try to uh, get to the soul system so I could do a recording there. Uh, just travel around there. Not to say that you guys don't know it. I mean, hey, we live there. <laughs> but it'd still be pretty cool. FU City. Huh, okay, that sounds interesting. Let's go there. Oh, hey, what do you know? I'm already pointing at it. Charging! So we're going to frame shift mode. We're not going to hyper speed. Because it's within the system. Let's see how far away it is. 370 light years. Not bad. So, yes, we are currently in the Roz, uh, was it 210 system? Yep, yeah, Roz 210. And, of course, you can travel to other systems that we know of in our galaxy, such as the uh, uh, Alpha Centauri, which is the closest system to the Sol system that we know of. And there's also, you know, I wonder if I can look at the Vicanus uh, Majora system, which is the largest known star in the galaxy. I think that would be freaking awesome to visit, assuming I don't uh, <laughs> collide with the star upon dropping out of... Uh, hyperspace that would be disastrous but it would still be pretty awesome uh to visit uh it, that system is known that star is known to uh let's see i believe it's going to go supernova within the next what 100,000 years or something like that not very long uh in uh galaxy terms okay come on let's go I'd like to find some trouble. I don't know if any of these stars around here has a ring. Rings, as I've shown you before, is definitely a place to show trouble. 
uh, in mining locations where the pirates are typically out to steal goods. Whoa, 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 slow, 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 slow thyself. Whoa, I overshot. Alright, 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 alright. It's alright, we'll just come back around. I am slowing down. Pardon me. There we go. Now we can speed up. Haha. <laughs> Getting a little ahead of myself. But yeah, as usual, the game looks great, uh, feels great. Uh, I'm going to have to clean my joystick again as it is getting a little creaky, but uh, the controls are still pretty fluid. I love that. Um, now, if I'm not mistaken, they've added uh, capital ships, uh, I think in the previous update. I honestly don't remember. But um, yes, we'll be, be able to see more action in this game, a little bit more stuff going on. I just need to do a lot more traveling around, do a lot more gameplay for that matter. I need to do more contracts and a lot of things, which will take too long to do in this video. So, uh, I, it, when, if possible, I would like to show y'all more action and more stuff and maybe a little more story to this game. Uh, it's just uh, time has been kind of running against me for this last uh, few weeks and I'm doing my best uh, to try to bring you stuff. I've been obviously active on the Life is futile, except for this last week, uh, due to events that I've already explained. Alright, come on. Let's get there. As you notice, the uh, throttle automatically slows you down as you approach your target, but you still have to do some throttle control. And you'll notice in the bottom right of the radar, uh, I kind of have to pay attention to that and to the target meters here, distance and speed, so I don't go too fast, or, you know, if I take too incredibly slow, it just takes forever to get there. But... We are getting there, nevertheless. All right, so my speed is now in the blue, in the safe. Come on, almost there, almost there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And safe disengage. We are now disengaging. We are now at Effie City. <laughs> Interesting name. Whoa, okay, now that's cool. Nice station, look at that, huge. Where am I going to find the docking port for this? I don't even know. I'm assuming it's on the end there. Yeah, I think I see it on the end. So let's speed up. you got to get within 7.5 kilometers before you can request docking. So we will do just that. Wow, that is a big station. Kind of place you don't want to start trouble. But hey, if other people want to start trouble, I'm all for that. Now in this game, you, uh, from what I've been reading, <clears throat> you have to be uh, logged online to actually start a solo. You can play solo. You don't have to play multiplayer, but you have to have internet connection to actually play solo, which is, uh, I've had mixed feelings about that for some time, but hey, I have constant internet connection all the time, but there are places where constant internet connection can be difficult to get just because of simple location and I you know to me if you're gonna buy a game like this for so much money it's it's kind of a pain in the butt for that sort of thing all right starport request docking 31 okie dokie let's go ahead and deploy our landing gear so we're automatically slow Become quite pro at landing these things. Of course, watch me say that and collide with something. Alright, docking 31. Where's 31? I see 12, 43. Ah, there's 31 right over there. You know, actually, I've noticed the station's a little more optimized with the Oculus. Usually, it's a lot more. Uh, a lot more jittery in here, but it's not that jittery right now. It's actually a lot more smooth. I still get a little bit of jitteriness, but not much. Not not as obvious as it was before. Okay, I need to throttle down a little. Come on. Go a little faster. Just don't overshoot. Get a little closer. There we go. 
and level out a little bit. Go forward. There we go. Not too much. And we land. Excellent. But it looks good as ever. And I would like to get more action videos for you guys because it's obviously, you know, as good as it looks, it's boring just watching me fly around. But I at least wanted to get a video update out there showing that, hey, it is now in Gamma. You can now explore the entire galaxy, which, pff, you know, it's not going to happen. You're not going to be able to explore the entire galaxy. It's just impossible. But you could at least, you know, if you want to, record some of your own videos to show some of the stuff that you find out there. I've hardly gone anywhere. I would love to, though, as I find time, as I said. Uh, I really want to get more into this game as much as possible. And in my recovery, I'm definitely going to do that. All right. Good. It's only going to cost me three credits to refuel because I've only got 67 credits. I really need to find some trouble out there and earn some credits. Uh, I notice there's a lot more on here. Uh, there's a market. Bulletin board so I could do some stuff. Waste refinery services. Now offering freelance contracts. It's only 3,000 credits. Come on. I could just go out and kill some folk for that. Crop busters. Hmm. Space dusters. That sounds interesting. At some point, I do need to scoop from uh, those uh, stars. And I think that's what this is for. Whoa. I notice that when I'm in this screen, when I look over at the menu behind this one, it kind of fades out, which is weird. But, okay, aquaponic systems, that's the cargo. Quantity 12, time left zero. Looks like I cannot accept this one. I don't exactly have the system. Okay, I don't, I don't think I can do this one, so I'm going to decline. Available, but unobtainable. Oh, well, obviously. Oh, I'm glad they separate those out. So the only missions I can accept are these first ones. Good rates, payable for easy work. Eh, I don't want it too easy. Local delivery, come on, something, you know. Uh, waste refinery. Eh, cargo, cargo. Don't get me wrong, cargo's kind of easy, but I would like to do something a little more complicated. But I ain't got to worry about it in this video. I'm going to keep this video brief just to show you that, hey, we are in Gamma State. Well... Elite Dangerous is in Gamma State. I'm just going to go ahead and enter the hangar so we can save the game. And this is where I'll start off uh, when I jump back in the game. F you, City. I'm sorry. That is just... <laughs> you, you know you're thinking it. You know you are! Uh, but anyways, with that said, I'm just going to say that uh, this game is pretty awesome so far. A lot of people have been playing this game now, and um, you should definitely look into it. Uh... <laughs> I will definitely be playing more of this game on the Oculus. And once I get some action recorded, I will post it. I promise. <laughs> there I go, making a promise. Uh, but yes, we're going to see more of this game. And uh, I'm going to hopefully get better so my voice isn't all raspy, hoarse, and all that stuff. Cutting out when I attempt at a high-pitched voice. <laughs> but uh, yeah, come back and we'll uh, get some more videos uploaded for you. So with that said, y'all come back. Now you're here. Bye.